Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm Zeke, and welcome to the Dream Green Show. In this episode, I'm bringing you your next home run stock. I'm, I really mean it, baby. I got on my King Griffey Jr. Seattle jersey on, knocking home runs out the park. The home run derby king himself. I'm about to tell you guys in this video what stock is about to go public that has the potential to double in the very near future. And if you know, then you already know. So make sure you stick throughout this whole video because I'm gonna tell you guys this company CEO. I mean, this he came from a pretty nice Fortune 500 company, guys. The CEO of this company. Also, this company is doing something brand new, very innovative in the cryptocurrency market that can make this company potentially triple, not just double, but triple. And I'm gonna give you guys the information on when exactly this company is going public and how can you get in on it right now. But before we dive into it, this video is brought to you by Weeble. Sign up now by clicking the link down in the description, deposit $100, and now you can receive two free stocks valued up to $1,850. With those two free stocks, you could keep them inside the platform and decide to use it, or you can sell those two free stocks and withdraw all of your money. It's literally free money. Also, I left a link down in the description to Coinbase. That is by far the easiest way to buy and sell cryptocurrency and if you want to earn some passive income on your cryptocurrency i left a link to blockfi you can stake your cryptocurrency over there and earn up to eight percent interest on your cryptocurrency but enough talking let's go ahead and dive straight into this video welcome back dreamers once again, King Griffey Jr., the home run derby king, is gonna help us knock out this next home run stock. Right now, my account is at $55,967. On the day I'm doing pretty good, I'm up 1%, $590.57. And for today, I went ahead and picked up this amazing company that's about to come out. I picked up 40 shares. I'm eventually gonna get 100, but today I picked up 40 shares, and this company has the potential to do amazing in the very near future. They're going to go public in sometime late Q2 or early Q3. But let's just go ahead and dive into the stock that I bought. And then I'm going to give you guys all the information about this company on why I think it has the potential to 2 or 3x in the very near future. Okay, guys, here we are on the SPAC. The SPAC is a special acquisition company that... Um, these private companies use they use specs to go public so they don't have to ipo it is a long process to do an ipo so they rather spend money and merge with these spec companies they're just like blank check companies there waiting for a private company to go public and the company that is going public with this spec muds is tops t-o-p-p-s yes that's right tops trading cards the collectible cards the ones that made baseball trading cards famous throughout the years guys that to where you could buy a baseball card that's worth over a thousand dollars per card or even five hundred dollars for a pack that hasn't even been opened guys so that is the company that is going public tops that's what as you could tell that's why i got on my baseball jersey of king griffey jr and let me tell you guys on why this company is going to get knocked out the park already today it is up seven percent on the day if we look at the last three months this um this spec first went on to the market in january 2021 waiting to find a company to merge with and as you guys can see the news came about and this company skyrocketed all the way up to 14 dollars it started at around 10 dollars and it went all the way up to 14 dollars and that was a great entry point for me and i'm gonna tell you why i think it was a great entry point for me right now wait before i get into it i did pick up 30 shares that's worth 421 dollars and 80 cents so now let's get into why i think this company is going to double but yes i do want to get 100 shares i picked up 30 shares today so i got about 70 more shares to go hopefully by the end of this week i'll pick up 20 more shares and that'll put me at 50 and then i'll grab the other 50 in about a week or so here we go on this CBNC news article. Top goes public through a SPAC deal. The SPAC that they're merging with is MUDS. Remember that if you guys want to get in on tops early, that is the tickle symbol that you're looking for right now. It's MUDS. Some of the key points are tops is best known for its trading cards will go public through a merger with a special purpose acquisition company. The former Disney CEO Michael Eiser will stay as tops chairman that's what got me very excited guys to see the former ceo of disney 
He knows what he's doing. He knows how to run a Fortune 500 company. This is what you want to look for in companies, right? You want to see if they have an amazing CEO. Now, I promise you guys, if Elon Musk was to go off and start another company and you seen that he was the CEO of this company, all of you guys would throw all of your money into it because it's Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla right if jeff bezos the ceo of amazon goes off and start another company you guys would do the same thing so that's the same thing with michael Eisner. he was the former ceo of disney and now he's the ceo of tops and he's going to remain the ceo of tops and he knows how to drive business through these companies he know how to continue to publicize them he's not to advertise them he's going to keep on boosting up this price of uh of tops just like how he did disney here's another important key point tops deals values at around 1.3 billion dollars this is no small penny stock company guys penny stock company so yes you're grabbing a 1.3 billion dollar company for 14 dollars per share so a quick rundown former disney ceo michael Eisner will stay as tops chairman Murder Capital, which is a MUDS and accounts managed by Gameco Investors and Wells Capital Management are expected to invest an additional 250 million into the SPAC. Private equity firm Madison Dearborn Partners intend to sell most of its ownership in tops. But Eisen Firms, the Tornet company, will roll its entire equity stake into the new combined company. All right, so that is why I think the company is going to 2X. Now, why I think the company is going to 3X? Because now they're getting into the NTFs, non-fungible token market. That's right, the cryptocurrency market. They are now making digital cards. So not only that they're making cards that you could go out and physically buy, the rare ones that you might find inside a pack that might be worth $1,000. Now they're making NTFs, and we all know NTFs are going anywhere from $5 to five million dollars per ntf and for every ntf of their baseball cards that get sold the 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 maker which is tops is going to get a portion of it so let's say if i buy a thousand dollar ntf baseball card ken griffey jr and i sell it for a thousand dollars um tops is going to get 10 percent of that and whoever i sold it to if they sell it again tops is going to get 10 percent of whatever they sold it for and let's say 10 years down the line they sell that King Griffey Jr. card for $1 million. Tops is going to get 10% of that $1 million. So whenever that card gets sold to another buyer, Tops is going to get a percent of that profit. And that's why I think this company is going to 10x in the future. So back to this article right here. Tops net sales rose 23% in 2020 to $567 million, a record high for the company. While Tops is best known for its sports trading cards, it has branched out into interactive mobile apps to connect collectors and recently expanded to non-fungible tokens which is ntfs ownership of an ntf is recorded on a blockchain similar to the network that is underpinned cryptocurrency each ntf each nft my bad if i've been saying it wrong the whole time nft each nft is unique and can't be duplicated just like owning an original painting or a rare baseball card all right, so if you're confused, let me go ahead and pull it up because they are playing no games about these cars, guys. And some of these cars look absolutely stunning. Their NTFs look absolutely stunning from the regular ones all the way to the exclusive, the rare ones. So let's just go ahead and pull up on what some of these NFTs look like. And the proof is in the pudding. You're going to say, hey, 3X might be a low ball. I mean, right now you could get it at $14. This company could go up to $28 and possibly 35 in the very very near future especially with these nfts all right youtube here we are over on the topsmlb.com website and the first thing you see is top series one nft collection and guess what as soon as you click on it it is sold out sell ended sell ended it is completely sold out so let's take a look at some of these cars that was inside of these um collectibles some was going for $4.99 and this was going for $99. But if we go to Atomic Hub right here, over on Atomic Hub, this is the Chicago White Sox uh, worth around $7. And every time that these cars are sold, a percent is going to go back to tops, right? So let's look at some of the rare cars, the legendary exclusive cards. And there you go. 
right here this one is over four thousand five hundred dollars this one's over three thousand dollars this one's over nine thousand dollars and this one is worth over twenty two thousand dollars per card now these are the holographics cards this one's worth around four thousand dollars and are they gonna sell you bet your behinds they're gonna sell they're gonna sell this is probably one of one cards in fact uh it's numbered this is the number one edition this is number nine edition this is the number four edition so it's probably one of five guys or some of them it might be one of ten but since these are numbered editions and holographics and let's take a look at another ones of their baseball let's go to the rarity right here to um legendary exclusives check multiple sites all right so here we go guys this is one of one for 454 thousand dollars for this card here's another holographic 15 of 19 for two thousand dollars nine thousand dollars twenty two thousand dollars guys so are these are these cards gonna sell <laughs> you bet your butt you they're gonna sell and and let's look at the last one from their website that they're selling these on Ooh. And here go one over on nft hive look at this one with the red and blue stars changing behind the um the angels this one is already worth twenty two thousand dollars i'm not gonna lie that one kind of clean with it changing like that so these N nfts is gonna change tops cards collectibles forever and there we go guys let me know down in the comment section what do you think about tops going public do you think 14 dollars is a fair value or is it undervalued where do you think this company is going to be in a year i've been collecting baseball man i wish i had my book with me i've been collecting baseball cards ever since i was a little, little toddler a little toddler and now that they get inside the nft area i'm able to get back into these collectibles again as a, a as an adult i'm able to spend a little bit more money find these rare cards that i really really like once they come out when a ken griffey jr nft you already know i'm gonna be the first one to buy it if y'all come across it go ahead and send it my way let me know but yes uh them getting inside the cryptocurrency market is definitely going to make this company 2x if not 3x in the very near future so this is our next home run stock guys let me know what you think down in the comment section but other than that go ahead and grab your two free shares by clicking the link down in the description by signing up for weeble and getting your free stocks guys it's literally free money but other than that i'm zeke bringing you the dream green show and i'm out peace